this great effort of the community coming together will produce over five million masks. It will produce face shields to keep our, our, our caregivers safe. It'll produce PAPR units, which are very sophisticated units. Again, suppliers aren't able to provide and gowns to keep our uh, caregivers safe. This event has been um, challenging for all of us, but it has really brought out the best in our communities. I love being a part of community service. I do have a daughter-in-law who does work for IHC hospitals, want her to be safe, want my grandchildren to be safe when she goes home at night, so I'm grateful for the opportunity to do something that I feel will benefit the community and, and my family indirectly as well. It's not a money issue, it's a supply issue. It's not there, we can't get the stock. All of our suppliers are on back orders and we can't get any of the additional items we need right now. So being able to look to the community to do this for us, it brings us all together and, and it's, it's all for a cause that helps us all. I would say gratitude permeates everything that we're doing. Um, we know who is volunteering, we know where the PPE is going. It's hard to actually put into words about how grateful we are, how grateful our staff is, uh, just with the community outpouring and love that they've shown. When you sew a whole bunch of masks like I've been doing, you gotta get creative or your mind turns to mush. When the chance came up for us to help those that are in need right now, we were excited for an opportunity that we could do all of us together from home. From Tuesday to Friday, our family did 100 masks. As one of the leaders of Project Protect, I want to express my heartfelt appreciation for the sewers who have volunteered hours of time and sacrificed and given not only your time, but your generous expressions of love and support for the caregivers that provide care to patients every day and are putting their lives on the line. Your examples of service and goodness have made us all better. I am proud to be part of Project Protect because of you, because of your generosity and your selfless service to the community and to the caregivers who are striving to keep people safe in this difficult time. Thank you.